This right there was the moment that the Ballon d'Or was won. The most memorable photo of the Euros. St. Jude saves England. Without Bellingham, England do not win the Euro. Harry Kane could only watch right through a wall of Slovenian defenders or Slovakian defenders. The 2024 Ballon d'Or is the 68th edition of the Ballon d'Or. I correctly predicted Lionel Messi to win last year's award because Lionel is Camacho 67. Because he won the World Cup during that calendar year. It is a three lion star that is going to win the 68th Ballon d'Or. Now that should tell you that Jude Bellingham, who already won the championship against his former team, Borussia Dortmund, is going to win the Ballon d'Or right after his bicycle kick leads the three Lions to a European championship. It is championship the English ward for championship that is Gamatria of the 58 years that England would go uh, without winning a title in reverse Gamatria. It is the three Lions of England that is Gamatria 68. So a star of the three Lions will win the Ballon d'Or and it is Bellingham that is going to take all of the glory. Bellingham is Gamatria 52 and the nominees will be announced on September the 4th. The amount of time from the Euro final to the day that the nominees are announced is 52 days. Bellium is Gamacha 52. And when you include the end day, it would be 53 days from the final to the day that the nominees are announced. Three Lions by itself is Gamacho 53. The champions in the German language is Gamatria of 53. And instead of the Three Lions beating Spain in Spain's 53rd Euro match all time, I will go with England spoiling a Bastille Day for Kylian Mbappe and Les Plus. But I don't care which team wins between uh, Spain or France. The only relevant thing is, is that England are the Die Meister, the champions. So 52 days, end day not included from the Euro final uh, to September the 4th, the day that the nominees will be introduced. Germany is Gamachi of 106 in reverse. The amount of time from the Euro final to the day of the Ballon d'Or presentation is 106 days from the time of the final at Germany. Jude is Camacho 68. This is the 68th Ballon d'Or. Jude Bellingham is Camacho Berlin in Camacho. Jude Bellingham is Camacho 75. Um, okay, it's not five days, end day over there. But this is the moment. Well, actually... What is the amount of day from the bicycle kick to the Ballon d'Or? I always get Slovakia and Slovenia mixed up. That was actually uh, June the 30th. But notice how they score after 90 minutes against Slovakia. That was a scripted goal. Because, again, England was the most bet on team on a match the match basis. So it's scripted for the bets to lose in 90 minutes. Only one win inside 90 minutes. But look at England. They're in the semifinals. A three Lions star to win the 68th Ballon d'Or. That guy will be Jude Bellingham. It is one monstrous bicycle kick that did the job. Bicycle goal for Jude Bellingham. Bicycle goal is Camacho of September the 4th, 9-4. Bicycle kick goal is Camacho of Olympia Stadion. Yeah, that is the stadium that is hosting the final.
Ballon d'Or is Camacho 93. I have speculated that Harry Kane could win Ballon d'Or, but now it's obvious that yet again a Real Madrid star is going to win Ballon d'Or. Kane could still win Golden Boot, but Bellingham is clearly the Ballon d'Or at this point. And it's 93 days and they included from uh, Harry Kane's birthday to October 28th. But better yet, let's connect uh, Bellingham his birthday. You know, notice how he scored the day after his birthday too. Or what is his full name when you copy and paste it in the calculator? His birthday is the 29th. Jude Bellingham scripted Ballon d'Or. A revelation. The bicycle goal. Bicycle 59. The moment that Jude Bellingham has won the Ballon d'Or. What about the day of the Champions League final? Um, June the 1st, the amount of time from that day to the Ballon d'Or for Jude Bellingham. Revelation 149, you know, a Real Madrid star, an England star, would win the Ballon d'Or 149 days from June the 1st to October. Great stuff. And then July 14, again, champion is champion in English. 43 days, champion in the English language, in the German language, Gamachi 43. So how many goals uh, would that be in this calendar uh, year? Or better yet, what's the birth for Bellingham? His Starbridge England's Gamacho 102, Jude Bellingham to win the Euro in Gareth Southgate's 100 second match in charge. Football is coming home. Football coming home is 102. Uh, Berlin in, in reverse is 102. And uh, they would beat the Orange of the Netherlands and route to Gareth Southgate's 102nd match in charge. So the birthplace of Bellingham equals the 102nd match of Gareth Southgate's managerial career. You know, you know, a Real Madrid player, so Real is Gamacho 36. He could win the Euros in his 36th match as a player. Los Blancos, or I, it's not Gamacho 36, but I do like the connection to Argentina win their first World Cup since uh, um, 1986 um, for Bellingham to win the Euro in this 36th match than the face-off against Argentina in the final Eastern mode. So Argentina won their first World Cup in 36 years. The calendar year, he's at 24 goals. Not sure what 24 is about just yet. But we will get to that point. How many appearances for the entire season would that be? 49 appearances, 49 is the Gamache of Madrid. Madrid is Gamache 49. He's a Madrid star. 49 total appearances for the entire season. You know, what's the amount of time that he joined Real Madrid to the time that he, he wins the Ballon d'Or? To the time that he wins the Euro from the time that he became a Real Madrid player, June the 14th. So 
basically exactly 13 months after became, after he became a Real Madrid player is when Jude Bellingham wins the Euro. Exactly 13 months after he became a Real Madrid player. So there you have it. But then also, as it ties into the Ballon d'Or on October the 28th. The 72nd week after becoming a Real Madrid player, uh, Real in reverse is Camacho 72. Not Mbappe's. Mbappe, I would look out for uh, for the 72nd Ballon d'Or. Now. Football is coming home, right? Home is Camacho 67. After 67 Ballon d'Ors, belly um, to win the Ballon d'Or. Belly um, with the winning goal against Serbia in the Euros, let's not forget. So belly um, has made the difference. He won the group for England. His goal against Serbia, he they won against Slovenia. Well, he didn't do much. But you remember, he, he played for Dortmund. So so at Dortmund's home ground is hosting the England semifinal against the Netherlands. So Bellingham is going to absolutely star in that show. Score a goal, maybe, possibly, maybe most likely. If he does, then, you know, not only the football is coming home, but also the Ballon d'Or is coming home to Mr. Jude Bellingham.